reading the recommendations that they have for the legislature because I think you know, the biggest thing to me that should come, come out of this is to improve the process. Um, and so I, I haven't had a chance to see what those recommendations are. I know some of them are related to OD, some of them may be related um, to schools specifically. So we'll see. If, if it appeared that something could be done legislatively, even small and technically, or even a larger sense, I mean, is it your? I mean, maybe you're guessing, but do you think that the legislature would be willing to take this up in the lame duck? I think it depends on the urgency of the recommendation. I, I think until we read what the specific recommendations are, whether or not we do it in lame duck or next uh, um, January, February remains to be seen. Do you mind if I put this on you real quick? How big a scandal? How big a scandal? You've been around many years. How, how big a scandal? Do you, do you, do you, how do you classify this in terms of? I, I think we don't know yet. Um, we've got a preliminary report out of 100 schools. We're showing evidence of five. A couple of those we knew going into it. Um, I s do not think we still have an idea of just how wide the scope is of this. And the thing is, it's very different at each of these schools. I mean, for example, what we heard in Cleveland was a very different issue when they're not taking kids to court um, before they declare them as truants. It's very different from what we heard in Marion County where they're to putting kids in this digital academy that's now gone away. Um, so these are different issues, different uh, re responses, and the motivations may be all over the place. And uh, just so what the exact problem is, I think we still don't know. Have you heard the argument from some people that... Uh, well, these grade cards and these assessments are unfair, so so maybe it wasn't so bad that people tried to get Have you heard that argument? And what's your response? A little bit, and not a whole lot. Um, we're currently working on a new report card and a new accountability system and trying to listen for those sort of um, uh, sentiments being expressed by superintendents that they don't like this or that the way we're currently doing it. But regardless of whether it's fair or not, it's the law. And all of these um, superintendents and principals across the state are required to follow the law whether they like it or not. Kind of along the same lines, 